Eureka! Hello everybody, I'm your friend in with Let's Players. By the one I welcome you to Let's Play Eureka! The prehistoric age. My vigor is 50 apparently. Yay! We get a fanfare even when the game starts. You are in a rocky gully. Paths lead out to the south and east. So yeah, this is a graphical text adventure that I used to play. It's very interesting because you go through time in different time periods. You start with the prehistoric age, then you go to Greece, and then there's Roman age, and uh, medieval age. I don't know. I never got that far in this game. <clears throat> it's kind of tough. Especially when you start at the prehistoric age where cavemen fight the dinosaur. Yeah, like that happened. Let's go south. Because why not? You are standing on the savanna near the jungle's edge, which is to the south. You see a tiny mouse scurrying in the grass. Get mouse. Well done. No, oh, it's a well done mouse then. Do I? Can I check my inventory? You have a tiny mouse. Look. You see nothing special here. Can I go back north? Well, of course I can. I mean, why couldn't I? Let's go east. And here we find... You have come to a patch of gravel strewn with boulders. Mm, any exits here? You see a piece of flint. Get flint. Well done! Thank you. Can I go more east? Yeah, some of these places don't have a clear exits. You can see shapes flying in the air above, far above. The base of some mountains. Uh, I'm going back west. Pterodactyls! Or something else. Uh, let's go north. Can't do that! And I go south. Of course. It takes me to the jungle. You are in a hot, humid jungle. Overgrown trails lead off in all directions. You hear a fearsome roaring and crashing behind you. You turn and see a Tyrannosaur is heading for you. The Tyrannosaurus runs after you, roaring continuously. Use mouse. And can I use the mouse? You can't do that. Give a mouse to... Your final vision is of its razor-shaped teeth closing on you. Chompy chomp chomp. And there goes my vigor as I die. <clears throat> you have failed this time. Go any direction to restart. Yeah, tough game, especially when there's Tyrannosaurus and, and Pterodactyls and all that in prehistoric times. Yeah, remember, humans and dinosaurs live together, right? It's always funny when g movies and games do that. Let me go get the flint as well. I actually do need to get some wood. Can I... Nothing special here. I do remember if I find some a stick or something, I can make myself a spear and then attack the uh, dinosaur. Tyrannosaurus. Um, where could I go? North? No. Continue east? I'm gonna look around at the base of mountains see if I can find something useful around here. Anything useful? No. Can I go north? Nope. Can I continue east? Nope. Can I go south? Yes. What is here? More jungle? Ew, a pond. You are in a murky swamp. Leeches cling to your legs. There are mountains to the north and... Well. That happened so fast that they didn't have even time for a reaction. He, I think he was just taking a... Maybe he was taking... A uh, bath in the swamp. And uh, I decided to just jump on my head. What an asshole. I really hate that dinosaur. But then again, who doesn't like the Tyrannosaurus Rex? Tyrannosaurus Rex. Yes. Tyrannosaurus Rex is so mighty and uh, formidable. Can I continue going south? Yes, I can. 
There are other cavemen around somewhere. Okay, north! Let's go! We are not going that way! Oh boy! Can't do that, can't do that. Anything else around here? No. Where can I find a stick? It would be nice to find one. Can I go west? Can't do that. Can I go north? Can't do that. East it is, and from here we go south. At least that's what I remember. Anything else here? Nope. Can I take a look around before the Tyrannosaurus Rex comes around? Nothing special. North. Not gonna stay there for a long time. How did I get to the swamp? From here? From the mountains? And hopefully this time the Tyrannosaurus will not jump on my head right away. South river flows south of you, the west is says jungle. Okay, so I'm going south, because that's what I saw first. There's a swamp to the north, yes. Paths lead east and west. I will go east. You are standing on top of a vast tall waterfall, which thunders into the lake beneath you. The river bank runs to the west. Anything here? You can see a hidden staircase carved into the side of the waterfall. Well, first I'm gonna find something else before I go there. And also, I think when it shows where you can type, it shows like the question mark and the exclamation mark flashing. That means that there's going to be an action there. Or red rub. If we have ever seen the shiny, he does this. When Tony speaks. You are standing on the northern bank of the swiftly flowing river. Trees grow all around you. Dark shapes swim in the water. A path leads to the east. I think there might be piranhas in the water. Okay, going back east. Let's go to the staircase and see how badly I will get murdered. <clears throat> Can I actually go south from here? Nope. Uh, go staircase, maybe? I don't understand. Maybe I can continue going east? You can't do that. Down? Ah, down. Yeah, of course, because you don't go down the staircase or the river. You're on a slab of rock on the northern bank of a clear lake. A rough stone staircase leads up to the cliffs. <laughs> to the south, the lake merges into a swamp. You can see a hidden staircase carved into the side of the waterfall. I guess that's how I got here. Let's go to the south, then, to the swamp. You are on the surface of a clear lake. There are several rock slabs to the north. To the south, the lake merges into a swamp. Anything here? Continue south to the swamp. And I'm gonna ready. You are in a marshy, swampy region south of the Great Lake. There's a volcano to the west and a savanna to the south. You see a huge, long necked Brachiosaurus munching on the vegetation. Get l actually look log. You see a hollow log. Get log. Well done. So I got a mouse, a flint, and a log. Hmm. Combine log and flint. Okay, let's take a look. Was it south and west? Ah, your sudden movement upset the Brachiosaurus. It treads on you. Uh, I should have used the mouse there. You know, mouse is scared elephants, so maybe it works on Brachiosaurus as well. <laughs> maybe. Ah, oh, this game is such an issue. I <clears throat> I think I have managed once get through this era to get to the uh, Greek era, but uh, it's not easy, not easy at all.
if you haven't noticed. And every, even if I do get all these items and everything, it still says that completed 0%. Maybe the completion is when you actually get through the era. Um, I do not know. Can I go east? Can't do that. Can I go north? Nope. Okay. Can it go through the mountains then? Keep going south. And now we go east. Down, 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 down. Can I go east? Can I go west? I will go south. Let's go say hi to the Precious Harris again. Can you get log? Use mouse. You use you use you use me me muse use muse. You can't do that. Uh give mouse to Saurus. Give mouse to Bracky or Release Mouse. You can't do that. Look, game, give me something. That's it, I give up. I give up. Yeah. This game just doesn't like me at all, <laughs> apparently. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. I thought I would release the mouse and it would scare away the Brachiosaurus so I could get through. But apparently not. There's some other kind of logic into this game that I don't get. So. There you go, a recap as far as I can get. So thank you everybody for watching, hopefully you enjoyed, and I hope you all have a good evening, good afternoon, and a good morning, and I will see you all next time. Don't start the game again, I'm not gonna play it anymore. Take care, people. Bye. I'm looking at you, game.